Hello and welcome to Activate for Kids. We would like to show you today the Streetwise buggy and go through some of the daily functions. Um, this is a buggy that we produce for mainly children who need postural support as a result of brain injury, cerebral palsy or some other developmental delay. So we have in the seat unit a wide range of postural support and the seat is able to tilt and it's also able to recline and with the crash tested base we're also able to carry a lot of uh, life saving equipment that some children need to carry with them. The large equipment tray on the base chassis takes suction equipment and other things. So we'd be glad if you just have a look, see what we have to offer. Please watch and enjoy. Thank you. So here is the uh, Streetwise seat unit. At the top here we have where the headrests attach, a flap here which allows you to attach the headrests and this fits down either side. And then we have also positions for the harness slots, they come through and fix onto the back of the chair. The latches supports here are width and height adjustable and there's various different depths so that we can come out further here. And the hip guards are also width adjustable and we supply the additional flexi pads here which allow you to change the width setting from day to day depending on whether you need to be fitting a coat or not. The footrest is also angle adjustable by pressing the buttons on both sides you can then release and reset and then the height of the foot plate can also be altered by releasing these two fixings and choosing the new position on the rails by tightening like this. The footrest folds up for loading and unloading you can also take ankle huggers and foot straps to the footboard. Now let's have a look at the brake. The brake is obviously to the rear of the buggy. It's an arm here which you lift up and down. which locates with a pin into the cog which is attached to the wheel. So when you apply the brake you push down and then just rock the buggy to make sure it's located into the nearest cog on the wheel. Very light and easy brake to use. I'm doing it with my hand. You can do it with bare feet. Very comfortable brake all round. Now we'd like to show you the tilt in space mechanism for the Streetwise buggy. It's found here at the base of the seat. This red button, you simply press that down which releases the gas strap and then you move back to the tilt position you require. Then obviously steadying the backrest, press the button again and bring it back into the upright position. The recline mechanism is also located here. Turn the lever handle three to four turns to release the lock and then the pin to locate in the various hole settings in the backrest recline. This is especially for useful for children who are tube fed, obviously you enable them to accommodate the feeding much more conveniently. And when set, lock in position. To remove the seat, release the safety catch here, which has to be pushed backwards, which enables you then to release the main catch, which then will allow the seat to be removed. To replace the seat on the chassis, ensure that the hooks at the rear of the seat base are located around the rear seat tube and then ease that down push the front edge seat forward so that the catch is again located. To fold the chassis place the seat carriage tilted forwards then taking hold of both of these seat catch releases release them and fold the frame over To reassemble the chassis, take hold of the handle like so and push forward and over. Make sure both catches are located in position. The Streetwise casters are fitted with caster locks which are just operated by rotating and allowing to slip into the catch. These are very useful for wheelchair accessible vehicles to stop those casters spinning and locking while going into a confined space. Also very useful for public transport where there isn't any securing system and this helps to prevent the buggy from sliding out sideways. The Streetwise buggy is crash tested and restraints should be fitted first to the front 
around this tube here where the label is, tied down to the floor. Then the rear tie downs are fitted to this bracket here, tied back down to the floor. Well, thank you for watching and please look out for some of our other products on the videos that we have.